All right, I am so excited to tell you about Fit Life Groups. This was an idea that I came up with because, you know, just thinking back over the last five, six, almost six years now, and watching the business and how things evolve and change, what I've noticed is you, you absolutely can build this business 100% online. You can. And for a lot of people, that's a great option. But you can also build this business in person. And there's a lot of people who prefer to do things in person. There's a lot of people who may never become a distributor because they think the only way to build the business is online and they would they don't use social media. Maybe they don't do anything online. Maybe they're not comfortable using social media, but they would build it in person. And I was thinking, you know, of our first uh, 50 ambassadors in this company, half of them were 40 and over. Now, I would say the last 50 ambassadors, because we have about 100 total, a little bit less than that, but the last 50 ambassadors that have promoted have all been 30s or younger, and they all primarily use social media. Now, that doesn't mean that you can't build this business offline anymore. It's just that we've taken the focus uh, from building this business offline, and we've really put it on to social media. And all, again, that's, that's a great option for so many people and you can build this business 100% online. But I really feel like we might be missing a huge group of people or several groups of people and doing ourselves a disservice and doing them a disservice by not focusing on building this business in person as well. It's another option for you, another fishing pole. And there might be some people out there who just strictly wanna build the business offline and do this all in person. There might be people who wanna do it hybrid, where you know they meet people in person, they do things in person, they get them onto social media, and they use both. And we just wanna make sure that we're giving everybody those options. So in thinking about this, and how, you know, what can we do? What can we do to keep it fresh? Make, you know, I, I've really been convicted that we need to make all things new. And, you know, how can we do that? Rap parties are great, but people are used to parties now. People know what, happen at a, what happens at parties. They know probably they're going to get asked to buy something at the end. Parties can still be really successful, but what can we do to freshen it up? You know, thinking about today's world and even thinking about the direction of social media, today's world, we need relationships. You know, we have all become so busy um, and, and so many of us just, we, we stay secluded in our homes. Even though social media and online, we can be more connected than ever, a lot of people feel more disconnected from humans and, and relationships and friendships more than ever. So all of that, I've been thinking about all that, okay? And, and what I came up with was this idea of a fit life group. Fit life group. And you can think of this as a hybrid between a Weight Watchers meeting and a church life group. Churches do these things where, you know, uh, either by neighborhood or just organically, people come together and they meet in homes. And it's called a life group. But what if we could take that idea and merge it with a Weight Watchers meeting, which is impersonal and, you know, out, out in the public. What if we could merge the two of those together? And as distributors, what if we could host fit life groups in people's homes and in our home? And so that's kind of where this idea came from. And it's, you know, Acts 246 says, uh, you know, the way that the early church grew, and still today with, with life groups, the way that the early church grew and really impacted lives was meeting in each other's homes, breaking bread together, doing life together, and their numbers grew by the thousands. That's what Acts 246 says. So what if we could take that same idea and do it for our business? Because we want to put people first. We want relationships first. This is a relationships business. It always has been. Network marketing has always been about relation. It should. Successful distributors, it's about relationships first. So we did our very first Fit Life group meeting last Friday night in Northern Kentucky, and it was so much fun. Um, we started with everybody came in and everybody weighed, um, filled out a sheet, which I have and I will provide for you, filled out a sheet with their information, their starting weight, what their first goal weight is, um, a place for more goals once they hit that. Um, it has a log sheet, so each time we come back, we will weigh in and we will track weight loss. I also had tape measures available, so if anybody wants to track weight loss, they can. Uh, and I had areas for that on their sheet as well. Um, 
We're gonna keep them all in a notebook, just a spiral bound notebook with sheet protectors is all I have and I just stuck them in there. Um, and so when everybody came in, you know, that's that accountability part. That's that, let's see the wins, let's track our progress. So everybody came in, weighed, wrote down their stuff, and then we moved into the kitchen and everybody brought fit food, some type of fit food to share. So this is like potluck. And so you never know what you're gonna get, which is so fun. And then, so everybody brings fit food, everybody talks about what they brought, and then we ate together. You know, we shared all of these things. And during that time, we just talked about life. It just, it was so natural, guys. You know, think about when you get together with friends, what do you do? When you get together with friends over food, you talk about life, you do life together. So during that part, there, there wasn't any talk of health and wellness or fitness or anything. It was just life and it was awesome. So we ate fit food together, that was a great time. And then we moved into, you know, this time of, of sitting down in a circle and, and um, you know, in the living room, call it circle time, whatever you want. We sat down and um, since it was our very first meeting, we all kind of did our self-evaluations and then we set some goals together. So we talked about, you know, where are we right now? Why are these our goals? Why do we want to hit these goals? You know, what is our biggest, what do we think our biggest struggle or what is our biggest holdback um, thing that's going to hold us back? What's that going to be in, in trying to hit these goals? Um, and it was such an amazing time of sharing and, you know, sharing recent wins or sharing things we're struggling with or, and then, you know, of course there's, there's, it doesn't matter where you are in a fit journey or where you are in life. You, somebody else is there too and they can relate or they've been through it, um, and in the past and can, and can speak into you, um, and give you ideas and encouragement. So that was a really neat time. Um, it was only about half an hour that we sat and did that. Um, and the whole thing, this whole meeting lasted about an hour and a half. Um, we had a fit bar set up with all of our It Works products that they could sample. So we had keto coffee, we had um, chocolate greens, we had the shake, we had berry greens on the go. Um, we had, um, I had a bottle of cleanse out and now you could have uh, keto energy out on the fit bar, but we didn't make that the priority. You know, we weren't there to sell the products as the number one, okay? Even though the products came up in our conversation and throughout the whole night, the whole time. And that's the whole goal is how can we make this about relationships first while offering, and everybody knew that this was sponsored by It Works. I had an It Works shirt on. Um, I'm the distributor, I was the host that was the sponsor of this, of this thing, um, and we had the product sitting out. So we're not hiding the fact, you know, this is another way to grow your business, but we wanna put relationships and helping people hit their goals first. And so this was an amazing way to do that. So we had somebody there who had never tried keto coffee, so she tried keto coffee, she drank that while we were in our time of, of talking. Um, so it was just an amazing time. And, and again, the products came up naturally in conversation because we had distributors there as well and we talked about what we were using for support. Um, so we really think that this could be an amazing idea um, and, and we already have some other fit groups, fit life groups that are gonna start popping up in other cities um, and, and to do this. So we're gonna start by doing these every other week um, and getting everybody together. Guys, it's the same idea as a wrap party. It really is. If somebody wants to try a wrap, if it came up, if somebody wants to try a wrap, I would have wrapped them right there on the spot for $25 while we were sitting in circle time. Um, and it was just such a natural, organic way of doing this business. Um, so anyway, if you are interested, I'm gonna have all of my, um, the documents that we use, the, the log form, I will upload all of that. Um, if you guys want to use it, if you want to try this out, um, it, it, you know, guests can come who are not customers or a distributor. Guests can come and check this out. Um, and I'll give you, um, apart from this video, I'll do a little summary as well but, of, you know, kind of my ideas and what we'll do from here on out. Um, but again, a hybrid between a Weight Watchers meeting and a church life group is really what we're going for here. Accountability and friendships. Um, and, you know, maybe we can even tap into some of that Weight Watchers market. Um, where they don't have to go to Weight Watchers meetings anymore out in, you know, in a public, they could do it. They could have accountability and track their weight loss and all of that and their, and track their progress to their fit goal in someone's home with their friends. And I just think that's incredible. So, um, fit life groups, another option for you to build in person in addition to a wrap party, in addition to blitzing. So I hope you love the idea and try it out.